Hello, Wealthy family, and welcome to today's Mindset Monday. Thank you so much for coming and sharing some time with me. I love and appreciate you all. This is Chanel, Ascending Infinite Goddess. Welcome all the new subscribers. Thank you all. Our community is growing and flourishing. Like, we're almost to 2K. We're almost there. So if you fucking with me, hit that subscribe button. Okay? Thank you very much. <laughs> so on um, today's Mindset Monday, we are going to talk about letting your light shine okay and this is inspired by i mean me my spirit of course but my experience with one of my um a very close dear individual that i've known for quite some time they are a client of mine but they live in the area and because they've been a client for quite some time we communicate you know outside of our um set appointments and with this hurricane that just hit with um milton specifically because of where this client lives they were directly affected by the storm um dramatically and if you're watching i know that you don't mind me sharing this of course i'm going to keep it neutral but i know you don't mind me sharing this because as a member of the ascended master's realm this individual um is meant to shine is meant to glow and meant to help others through their experience um so there were statewide power outages of course uh the thing that really did the damage like i said before was the tornadoes the unpredictable tornadoes um which kind of tornadoes are unpredictable they pick and choose they destroy something here and the next right next to it nothing right um so this particular individual's power had not come on as of yet out in the tampa bay region and uh, they were they were very anxious about it and guidance was listen you're being protected you're being guided everything was working out in your favor it'll be okay just you know don't stress see yourself succeeding and that is what will come to fruition now easier said than done um if you are not a master of your spirit that means you're a master of your flesh and as us having this human experience in this fleshly vessel sometimes that is what takes over so the worry the anxiety can step can step in right um you're anxious you're not comfortable you don't know what's going on and uh, this individual's power came back on yesterday right sunday and it was after we had spoke and they were like wow i get it like the light just came on in my head the lesson is learned i got it see what was happening with their power their main line is underground so that wasn't affected <coughs> but because their main line is underground it feeds off to other individuals homes and or grids and if their grid has something particularly wrong with it maybe they still had flooding um maybe there were trees <coughs> sorry the roots shifted and it was causing you know issues where the workers couldn't get in to work the line or flip a switch or do whatever it is they had to do so this individual's power had to stay off it couldn't come fully online because of that right so basically it was the epiphany was i cannot keep allowing myself to be wrapped up in people's sugar honey iced tea because the concern because of the concern of other individuals my light can't shine my light cannot be bright and that is so much of our experiences every day right the train's throwing me i don't know if you hear the train but my little one does not like the train horn so i'm hearing him <laughs> and it's throwing me off um but yeah so much of us we will not allow our light to shine because we're so wrapped up in other individuals issues oh you're having a, a catastrophe you know you're having a epidemic you're having a crisis you are anxious you don't know what to do it's okay you know give it to me i'll take it on you know and you have your own things you're dealing with and you're not facing that thereby you're not allowing yourself to be a hundred percent once you allow yourself to be isolated and removed and neutral to other people's circumstances to their crises allowing you to focus on yourself 
you will allow the full power of you to come online allow you to shine brightly to assist others in a more grounded way see the lines have to be grounded the electricity you have to be grounded in order for electricity to flow correctly without sending off shocks without setting off distortments if your line isn't grounded which is good that this individual line was underground but if your lines aren't grounded meaning if you do not allow yourself to be grounded if you do not allow yourself to be here present in the plane of your own experience if you don't walk barefoot on the earth if you don't cleanse your aura if you're not dancing in the rain if you're not interacting with the grounding nature right if you don't have a grounding pad that you you know can sleep on your electricity your power is going to be stagnant it's not going to allow you to be full throttle be online and every time you branch off you create a new branch a new wire every time you create a new one to feed someone else's light electricity you're depleting your own power it's stifling you it's preventing you from thriving that's what mind your business and business your mind means. Shout out to Dr. B. Dr. B serious. Like be so serious. Be for real. Be, but it's serious. S-I-R-U-S. Like the star system. <laughs> be galactic. Right? But mind your business and business your mind means mind what you have control over. What it is you have going on. Mind your business. The thing that controls you. What is your business? and business your mind focus your mind on your business on the things that you have going on on the things that light you up you need to control that every time your mind wanders onto someone else's problems or you take on someone else's crap <clears throat> excuse me every time you do that every time you take that 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 energy on all you're doing is sending off electrical signals focus on this, focus on this, and you're wrapping yourself up into their issues. And when start, certain solutions start coming in or certain experiences start coming in, it can be based off of other people's experiences. You're mingling, you're, you're joining yourself with them. You're entangling your lines for no reason. And you're not, and then you're wondering, why is my life not working the way I want it to go? Why does my mind drift? Why is it every time I try to sit down and get focused on what it is I want to do, it keeps drifting and wandering? It's because you're not businessing your mind. Any successful business owner will let you know, priority, priority number one, priority number one is clear thinking, a clear head. You can't be emotional running a business. That's why I, I love my people. I love my people. That's why sometimes things turn up where it's, you know, yes, you have a business, but can I get a discount? Do you have a sale? Do you have a this? No, at this time, no, right? Every now and then maybe, but not every time, right? You got to have clear minds. You cannot be emotional, which is why some people feel that women can't rule or can't be a leader because they're so emotional. However, that is quite false. That is quite false. Okay? So allow your light to fully shine. Allow, allow yourself to be fully online and stop wrapping yourself up in other individuals' issues. Stop worrying about their roots their floods, their crises, their catastrophes, what it is that's causing them to have cloudy vision. You can serve them better when you're 100% online and when you are clearly thinking and when you are bright, like that light bulb going off epiphany, you can drown out their shadows just by being 100% focused on you. A lot of times you can drown out people's shadows. I'm out here casting away shadows and i don't even i don't know i'm not even aware of it i'm just authentically being me and then people are inboxing me emailing me texting me calling me catching me on the street and telling me hey i see you i see things that you do what you post how you move and just thank you because you've helped me and i feel that way about other people as well 
they don't even know there's people that i i, I be watching and i can't always or listening <clears throat> and i can't always interact because of whatever i have going on but i'm like man y'all have helped me you have helped me through some things everybody needs assistance but it's better assistance is better served from your grounded authentic strong core value self and not from a distorted cloudy mess okay so that is that that's all that i have for you today this mindset monday thank you all so much for coming and sharing some time with me i love and appreciate you all hit the like button hit the share button hit the subscribe button and until we connect again stay alert stay aware and live in love peace